Here is great execution of the defensive reaction to a man pulling, a man cracking back. The defensive player explodes with flipper and sheds the blocker in his pursuit to the ball. The next three shots show the difference when reaction is not as quick and the defensive man does not get control of the blocker's head. It is this minute difference that you should be concerned about. It is the difference the defensive reaction machine can make in your defensive players. Just a few moments every day can quicken the reaction of your defensive players. The movement of the helmet horizontally triggers the spring-loaded wing pad, which pops out at the man and simulates the action of the crackback blocker. Somersault and ball reaction can be added to expand the scope of the drill. Charlie McClendon has acquired a great national reputation for the quickness and hard hitting of his LSU defense. His basic theory is very simple. Defensive linemen must be able to explode, react, and tackle. As a staff, they spend a great deal of time coaching these basic fundamentals. The one-on-one -on -one drill probably tells a coach more about a player than any other single drill. The first couple of shots show what happens when the offensive blocker gets the jump on the defensive man. Coach McClendon feels this is an exemplary drill in that it embodies the prerequisites of great defensive play. It requires explosion on movement of the ball or a man, reaction to the offensive moves and making the tackle. These LSU Tigers are going all out. There are no wrestling matches or dances taking place. The defense is delivering a blow, shedding the blocker, and getting to the ball carrier. The whole coaching staff is involved each with his own specialty. Live and full speed, it is a tough drill. And while it identifies your football players, it can take its toll in injuries. The credit defensive reaction machine allows you to go full speed all the time while improving techniques and quickness with no chance of injury. The machine takes the beating, not the squad. As a player reaction improves, the coach can increase the speed of movement of the helmet and wing pads. Ball reaction, somersaults, and fumble recovery can be added to improve agility, quickness, and second effort. Soon, each man will be moving with movement and not after it. The best pass defense known is to tackle the passer before he throws the ball. Development of a good pass rush ranks high in priority of coaching pass defense. Most pass plays show first along the line of scrimmage. The reaction to this indication makes or breaks the pass rush. Only the call blitz can initiate a faster initial pass rush. Quickly and safely, this technique can be given the attention it needs every day on the reaction machine. It doesn't require a lot of people and a great deal can be accomplished. Reacting to a pass indication and rush. And draw action for the linebackers. Practice on the credit defensive reaction machine will improve your pass defense. With Coach McClendon, let's review how the machine works. For the straightaway block, rotate the helmet forward. For a man pulling, a man cracking back, move the helmet horizontally, triggering the wing pad. For the double team, rotate the helmet forward and simultaneously release the wing pad with the other hand. For the pass indication, rotate the helmet backward. Frank Broyles has fashioned a great record in Razorback Stadium. His defense is known for its quickness and great pursuit. Arkansas defense forces the turnovers that win ball games. This is the hand explosion drill. Linemen must learn to use their hands effectively. They must lock their elbows, take a short jab step, and deliver a blow. It is the best way to keep blockers away from the body. Since defense is a second effort action, 
The drill includes the basic action of delivering a blow to get rid of the blocker. They roll and learn to come off the ground and make a tackle. The commands in this basic drill are verbal. When the players have learned the techniques, two men can operate simultaneously. They react to movement, in this case the helmet, and they deliver a blow with the hands, then roll and make a tackle. The drill moves quickly and saves time. Of paramount importance in this drill is quickness. The next offensive input is pressure, fighting pressure. Here the player is reacting to movement and fighting through pressure as applied with a wing pad. Since every lineman is not strong enough to use hands all the time, some of these players are using the forearm flipper, which is a stronger position for them. Emphasis is also placed on footwork. One of the hardest things to ingrain in a football player is the necessity of keeping the legs and feet moving all the time. Good footwork ensures good balance and the ability to move or strike a blow in any direction while in a good football position. This is a body control drill. The offensive lineman can count on being knocked down. The ability to recover and come up to the ground quickly in good balance is important. There's a difference in being knocked down or blocked out of the play. This demonstration shows how the wing pad is automatically reset after each blow, ready for the next release. The action is that used for a right or left shoulder block. It is followed by the action used for the double team block. From Green Bay, the word is out. The Pack will be back under Coach Dan Devine. The Packers are returning to the football fundamentals that were the hallmark of the Lombardi years. This drill on the reaction machine is to improve quickness, agility, and footwork. Banging from pad to pad, moving with each sight indication, the credit offensive reaction machine gives them the advantage of being able to go full speed all the time, with or without pads, enabling the defensive player to develop his reaction to its optimum. Coach Hanner increases the speed of movement of the helmet as he sees the player's speed improve. It helps the big man to take shorter steps, keeping him in better balance to hit, react, and pursue. Just a few moments every day can make a big difference in your defensive play. It's important to know that the players like to work on the credit defensive reaction machine. See how these players are able to go full speed without pads. The famous Crother Enduro pads can absorb the hardest blows with complete protection to the player hitting the machine. Join the thousands of coaches who find that Crother machines are the best machines, a fact proven in 40 years of service to the coaching profession. Your field equipment is not complete without a Crother defensive reaction machine. There is simply no other way to sharpen reflexes to develop instant reaction to offensive moves as quickly, as safely, as surely. Why not order yours today so that you'll be ready to go with this revolutionary method of coaching defensive linemen? Wire, phone, or write, Ray Crother Company, Ardmore, Pennsylvania, 19003.